Good morning. Good morning. I Thanks read, for having me. I read that like I understood rugby, <laughs> and I do not. Um, and, no, and, that was perfect. Oh, okay. <laughs> there you go. I, I think of it course, really well. Yeah. Um, now, yeah. you, you were born in Sa San Diego, I or you grew up in San Diego, I thought. That doesn't seem to be a big rugby center to me. How did this come um, about for you? <laughs> Um, I grew up in San Diego, but my dad is South African, and I was born there, actually, before we moved to San Diego. So um, I had some rugby um, influence, but I only started playing once I went to school, um, to college, um, when I was 18. Sarah, when you first saw uh, considered rugby, it's just such a physical sport. Uh, was it slightly intimidating first? Because, you know, when I look, it doesn't seem like there's really a lot of protection in terms of, you know, protecting from bodily injuries. Yeah, um, it's, it is a lot safer than it looks. Okay. Um, you, since you don't have any protection, you're a lot more aware of what your body is doing. Yeah. Um, so... I think that like I'm not putting my head in places because I don't have a helmet. Like I, I am not going head first into things. Um, and yeah, it's and when I first started playing, I think that's what made would always make me run really fast was because at first I was really nervous and really scared to be tackled. So it do, it does make you run faster. But if you started in college, uh, your learning curve was pr pretty quick. How, how were you able to excel so quickly? Um, looking back, it doesn't feel very quick. It felt like a lot of years, but. Um, I played a lot of soccer, um, track, cross country, like tried a lot of sports when I was younger. I think I was a little more aggressive at, at those sports. And then um, when I found rugby, it was just the perfect, the perfect mix of everything that I wanted and the physicality. Um, I, I think I always wanted to play football as a young girl, um, but never found any leagues or anything, didn't really look into it. So once I got to college, uh, rugby was a perfect answer to all of my sporting prayers, I guess. So this is your first Olympics, right? Yeah. How does yeah. what was the experience like? I mean, you're leaving with a, with a medal, which is amazing. But what is, was it? Everything that you expected it to be? Oh, it's it's way more. Like I I going into it, I was like, this has to be overhyped. There's no way that it's <laughs> this cool. And then go like the first day in the village, I was like, oh wow, wait, this is this is really cool. This is this is incredible. Um, and then winning a medal on top of it, it against a team like Australia that we hadn't beaten in a while, and to beat like to beat like that when the times run out, um, it just like everything that you could have laid out as a dream, what just happened. It was it's incredible to leave Paris like that. Sir, congratulations to you. Very exciting. Learn more at teamusa.com, usa.rugby, and on Instagram at usa rugby. Congrats again, Sarah. Congratulations. Awesome. Thank you. Thanks for having me.